Welcome to 1914 Hollings Road here in Charleston, South Carolina. Um, or if you live out here, it's called James Island. So we are on James Island 29412. We are minutes from the James Island connector, which puts you to quickly to downtown. So this is a three bedroom, two and a half bath home, 1992 square feet. So some good size to it. Sorry about that, took off my flip flops. You don't want to hear that flopping sound as we go. So we're going to take a tour of the home, the three bedrooms, two bathrooms upstairs. We're going to check out the downstairs living room. Coat closets right there. I always like to point them out. Um, it's a little bit of a mess, so they asked me not to show it to you. Totally understand. And here is your guest bathroom. Yeah, nice guest bathroom. Here is your laundry room. This is the laundry room. And it's some good use of storage space over here. So that's underneath the stairs, some additional storage. And you have a nice open concept, open floor plan here. So you your living room, dining area, and then your kitchen. So as you can see, you got tall cabinets. There are um, nine foot ceilings. So you got tall ceilings, good. I'm not sure if this is granite or quartz, but it's good, nice hard. Surface, I like the black, the backsplash there. Stainless steel, black appliances. All these come with a home here in the kitchen. And then here's your pantry. So you got some good cabinet space and additional storage as needed. So the storage over here too. So I go kind of quick on the videos. Oh, farm style kitchen sink. Um, all right, as I mentioned, we, we'll, we'll head upstairs. I'll talk as we go. As I mentioned, we are just three, four minutes from Al, uh, James Island Connector. And then from there, it's just a few minutes downtown. So you could be at work downtown inside 10 minutes um, relatively easily. And then also, the nice thing is when you're coming home from downtown, you're taking a right off of the connector instead of a left. And if you're familiar with the area, you're not familiar with the area. Well, if you are familiar with the area, you know that that left turn gets backed up. So since you're going right, it's usually pretty quick getting home even during rush hour. So this is your uh, linen closet. You have shelving from there over to here. Again, it's full of some stuff. So you can see it if you come view it in person, but it's best not to take videos of it. So that will do. So this is the primary bedroom. It's got some space to it. You got a couch in here. I mean, how much more space do you need? Um, obviously, a king size bed can fit because that's what they have. And then you'd also have room for dressers and drawers and that kind of stuff um, if, if you so wanted those there. And then there's more space. <laughs> see, I told you there's space here. As you can see, they have it set up as a home office in here. So, um, so there's plenty of space here. Now, this is a walk in closet, um, it goes from this corner over to about where that outlet is down there and then it goes to about where that um, starts they're shelving on both sides and in the back again um, if you schedule a showing to see it in person you can definitely take a look at it then and here's your primary bathroom double vanity which is nice so that way there's plenty of space to get ready hey there's me hello I'm not sure if I mentioned it. My name's Aaron. I own Blue Water Property Management. Should have said that early on. Sorry about that. There's your shower. Then you have your toilet over here. And then you have more linen space. All right, let's go check out the other two bathrooms. I mean, two bedrooms and the bathroom. Um, we're just gonna go to the left. This is the bathroom, so we'll start here. Hey, surprise, surprise, there's me again. Hello. <laughs> All right, so here is the hallway bathroom here upstairs. And here is the secondary bedroom. One of the nice things with new builds, which I forgot to mention, this is a new builds built, finished in uh, late 2021. One of the nice things are the secondary bedrooms have some good space to them. One of the downsides to the video um, is it does, this video camera does make things appear a little bit smaller. And so I do recommend scheduling a showing to see it in person so that way you can get a real feel for the home. But if you like the layout and you think it's going to you know, work for you, highly recommend taking a look at it in person so that way you can feel the size of it. Um, 
So, because you could fit easily a queen bed on that wall there. You could easily fit a king on this one, right? You're covering the window a little bit. So, like, you got some space in here, but the video doesn't show it all that well. And we'll check out the. Oh, there we go. We'll uh, check out the third bedroom here. So, there we go. Here's the third bedroom. Both of the closets are you know, your standard size closets, they are not walk in. Uh, but they do have these upgraded doors, which are nice. And then, there we go. We can see all of it. All right, so let's go ahead and go check out the backyard. And then that way we can wrap this up. Oh, and we, you know, we'll check out the garage as we go as well. So, all right, we'll take a look in the garage real quick. And we'll check out the back yard. Won't go too much in here. They got storage in here. Um, two car garage, automatic garage door opener. As you saw the driveway when we came in, easily fit quite a few cars out there. You know what? We're going to walk in the backyard. Let me throw this step back into these flip flops. There we go. Warm weather, it was finally showed up here, so I'm embracing it. Alright, so the backyard is fully fenced in, which is nice, whether you have kids or dogs, or just one privacy for yourself. Um, and so, we'll go over this way so you can see. So it goes, goes to there. And so the backyard isn't as deep as what you would typically see in a, in a um, you would want in a yard, but the side yard is much bigger than you would normally get. Usually this would be, you know, where that first post is, right there. But you got all this additional space. As you can see, they've got, they've got toys out for their kids. And so there's plenty of usable space if you, have, if you have little ones. Room for your dog to run around in as well if you have one of those. So, all right, well, that's 1914 Hollings Road. I appreciate you taking the time to view this home. Again, like I said, the video camera does its own little thing. Things appear smaller than what they really are. So if you like the layout of the home, think it might work for you. Schedule a showing in person. So that way you can, you know, get a real, see the home and, and see how it would work with your belongings. Um, you can schedule a showing from our website. If you're watching this video, you're probably already on the website. But if you're not on our website, hold on over to bluewpm.com. Scroll down till you see the home. Click the link. Now, once you're on the showing page, I mean on our listing page, we have a showing request form we ask everyone to fill out. If you're on a desktop or a laptop computer, it is on that right-hand side there. If you're on a you know, tablet or a phone, it's probably down at the bottom. You just got to scroll down until you see it. All right. Well, thanks again. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I look forward to hearing from you.